The F-16 has been around since the 1970s and has become the most produced fighter jet in the world. It served for more than 25 nations and still today some countries are looking at the F-16 as an ideal solution to expand their defense capabilities in the near future. European country Bulgaria already started in 2012 to look to modernize its air force. Initially there were two options, the F-16 or the Swedish built Saab Gripen. Eventually, Bulgaria had chosen the F-16 over the Gripen to replace the MiG-29s. This resulted in an order where Bulgaria will receive a total of 8 F-16s in the near future. Slovakia were also looking to replace its aging fleet of MiG-29s and were also considering the Saab Gripen or the F-16. Just like Bulgaria, Slovakia had chosen the F-16 and placed an order of in total 14 F-16s. The first ones are set to join the Slovakian Air Force in 2022. Argentina has been looking for quite some time now to increase their fighter jet capabilities. Currently, Argentina is using unproduced AI-63 Pampas as well as A-4 Skyhawks who are already in use since the 1970s as combat aircraft. Argentina is apparently looking for an additional 58 fighter jets and the F-16 has come out as one of the most favorable solutions. Another future operator of the F-16 in South America is Colombia. The F-16 will replace the aging Israeli-built Kefirs who are in use since the 1980s. Colombia has already placed an order of a total of 24 F-16s, which are scheduled to arrive between 2021 and 2024. India has been investing quite intensively over the past few years in its air force, with the acquisition of the Rafale, the Sukhoi Su-30 and the Tejas. But apparently, India is also interested in acquiring additional F-16s. Another future operator of the F-16 in Asia is the Philippines Air Force. Currently, the Philippine Air Force are using South Korean-built T-50s for combat missions, but they have placed an order of a total of 12 F-16s in order to increase their capabilities. The F-16 still has a bright future ahead of itself. Let us know in the comments down below where you would like to see the F-16 in the near future.